Okay, uh, good evening, everybody. Uh, Alessia and Rina, uh, welcome to this presentation uh, of the new specializing master in design for food uh, that born uh, from the collaboration between Polytechnic of Milan and the University of Gastronomic Science of Pollenzo. I'm Franco Fascio and uh, I am one of uh, the four conveners of the master. But first of all, uh, why it's so important to activate a, a course, a master course or study uh, that connects the gastronomic science with, uh, with design? Because I think never uh, as today, uh, the food system needs to be redesigned to reduce its negative impact uh, on the environment especially and so therefore we must be courageous in imagining new economic and social paradigms that can contribute to redesign all the food chain to make a uh, food system fair healthy and environmental friendly also from farm to fork as the european commission asked us to do uh, through european green deal so the specializing mastery in design for food it, it is managed by Polydesign, the consortium company of the Technic di Milan, specializing in postgraduate training, and um, it um, recognizes how the contemporary food sector uh, that is already characterized by experimentation and innovation and design-oriented experience uh, is increasingly looking for a transversal experience dies capable able to create interacting design food engineering technological gastronomical skill for this uh, reason the master combines the design and food engineering competence characteristic of the polytechnic of milan with topics and focuses in the area of food connected with the humanities gastronomic science and food technologies that are uh, uh, typical domains uh, of the University of Gastronomic Science at Pollenzo. Well, um, the faculty of the master uh, in, includes professor from Polytechnic of Milan and the University of Gastronomic Science with the addition of qualified practitioners and collaborators in many, many uh, situations uh, that uh, are especially um, collaborators in companies. Um, to underline all of this, the importance of this new dialogue between universities and uh, disciplines, um, it was uh, decided also to set up a, a master board, I believe, uh, uh, full of professionalism. Uh, so in this way, uh, the master combines uh, theory and uh, uh, practice. Uh, by alternating lectures and um, hands-on activities with the uh, development of projects and assessments. For, uh, for this uh, reason, the, the teaching plan includes, uh, for example, lectures, obviously, aimed at introducing the main topic of study and uh, at providing tools and the methodologies for an analysis and design. Uh, includes also three important workshops with company uh, that uh, could be defined as uh, hand-on activities developed in laboratory approach, partly in collaboration with the external components, aimed at the application of, of tools and methodologies uh, for uh, product service ideas uh, development, and so um, to create a new innovation project uh, uh, and proposal. Um, also, another important thing uh, is that this uh, master offers two important study trips, uh, two educational trips aimed at in approaching the topics investigated from uh, experiences in real context on the food sector. This is a, an important uh, asset a topic made by uh, the University of uh, Gastronomy Science. And uh, after all of this, uh, Three important part. There is a, a, a four important part. Uh, one internship of 470 hours of training experience within a partners uh, of the master. 
or um, also suggested directly by the participant in agreement with the staff coordinating uh, the master. So um, the master uh, integrate, I think, extensive uh, skill with uh, thematic and specific competence in the food area uh, related to, as I said before, humanities, gastronomy, science, engineer, technologies. Um, it's important also to say uh, in this way that um, the date has changed for those contained in this uh, slide uh, um, as due to the pandemic situation. Um, in fact, we have decided to, to start the master in uh, uh, October 2021. But anyway, um, it's important to, to say that it's divided into three main models. Uh, first of all, an introduction uh, to the food sector to uh, analyze and understand the main elements that characterize the current food system. After that, uh, a period in which the students acquire the techniques and tools for designing through experimentation and uh, hand-on experience. This model is uh, also characterized by three uh, workshop, as I said before, developed in collaboration with external partners and uh, timed to the innovative product and service ideas. Um, and also uh, in this model, there is present two study trips um, and uh, uh, one uh, of, of these uh, study trips is uh, on local food system and uh, instead the second one uh, is on the uh, wine system. Uh, finally, uh, the internship in companies, agencies, institutions, and the final exam. In fact, the last but not least uh, um, section of this master is the final examination uh, requires a, that requires an individual presentation to the master board of the candidate's portfolio, uh, summarizing the activity and the result achieved through internship experience. In general, uh, I would like to add that Attendance uh, is compulsory for three days a week, and uh, a maximum absence of 25% is allowed. Um, at the end, uh, the university master diplomas uh, in design for food of the Polytechnic of Milan is uh, awarded. A qualification that has a value of 60 uh, GFU credits, the equivalent to 60 HTS uh, credits. So, uh, um, it's important also to, to say that the uh, headquarter of the master would be the Campus Movisa in, uh, in Japan, and um, also uh, that uh, the master attracts uh, a maximum of uh, 30 students, um, and also that specializing master welcomes candidates with uh, a degree or a specializing master degree in design, engineering, architecture, economics, or management, social science, humanistic science, obviously gastronomic science, agriculture, food technology, also a person that have an individual possessing other kind, other types of degree, um, with a significant past experience in the field of food innovation. Uh, the selection will be made by the selection of the student, obviously, will be made by the master's board on the basis of the documentation sent, uh, followed by a possible interview in English, not mandatory, also remotely, obviously, uh, due to the fact, due to, due to this pandemic situation, unfortunately. And um, uh, for the admission, the candidate skill, aptitudes, and expertise will be assisted. Um, admission may be subject to the following condition. Uh, students enrolled in a university whose final exam is scheduled later than the start of the master. A student with foreign qualification uh, whose validation has not yet been completed. And student with Italian university diplomas or three years qualification or qualification also acquired abroad may also be admitted. 
something more in, instead about the cost. Um, the specialized master admission fee is uh, 60,500 uh, um, euro. Um, 60,000 participation fee uh, plus uh, 500 enrollment fee at the Polytechnic of Milan. But for a student graduated at the Polytechnic of Milan and uh, to the University of Gastronomy Science, the fee is reduced to 40,500 euros. Uh, there is also there are also free partial fee uh, reduction, two of 25 percent and one of uh, 50 percent, uh, and this is also an important uh, important information I think. Um, the application and uh, grant of this partial reduction will take place during the admission process uh, to the specialized master and uh, will never apply after its starting date. Application for a partial reduction will be evaluated, obviously, by the Specialising Master Commission uh, on the basis of, of additional background for the 30%, professional experience for the 30%, and motivation for the 40%. So, um, candidates for a partial reduction will be selected based on the consistency of their profile, with the objective of the specialized master at the moment when their documentation is analyzed. Uh, the minimum score for being selected for one of the partial uh, reduction is uh, four out of five uh, on a one to five scale. Uh, so the partial reduction can be also, it's important to say, cannot be also uh, combined with other financial supports. Um, instead, also here, um, general indication about the master and about uh, the professional that can out from this master. The master in the Zen for Food aims to train professionals, independent innovators, entrepreneurship, entrepreneurs. So, uh, servant with skill in design of product service solution in the food sector and skill uh, for uh, the development of related process and uh, system. This will be practitioners whose profile combines the design and the experimental approach with a specific knowledge on the underlying logic of the food sector. Uh, in its extension, as I said before, from field to table, from farm, from farm to fork, uh, considering, considering also traditional innovative production and the distribution system with a specific attention obviously, to sustainability. At the end of the course, participant, participant uh, will be able to, first of all, uh, understand the social, economic, and environmental transformation of the food sector, use theoretical and critical skill to define design opportunities for a specific food sector, uh, design complex solution and concrete outputs in terms of product, service, communication, space also, and effects. Um, another important thing is uh, another important skill. Um, is that the, partici the participants uh, will be able to understand and to use the potential of the sector technology as well as the main elements of the production process of the different supply chain. Uh, also, it's important to underline the, the capacity to manage the main elements of the food safety and uh, uh, planning and uh, use also specific design tools to design and manage all stage in the process of uh, uh, conceiving, developing, and implementing an innovative solution. In um, an advanced perspective, I think that includes obviously uh, participatory and sustainable and sustainable uh, approach. So uh, this is a, a really short presentation, but for those interested, I know. Knowing for the details of the master, I invite uh, all of you to to go and visit the, the website 
uh, of the master indicated here, uh, or to write email uh, to the poly design or a UNSCG education office, or also uh, to me. And my email is f.fascio um, chiocciola uniscg uh, dot uh, and um, uh, so uh, thank you all for listening and um, uh, a cordial greeting to all I hope to see you soon uh, as soon as possible obviously I'm here for uh, for any kind of question so uh, if Alessia Andreina uh, Dimitra, Yeka, uh, if you have some questions, I'm here for uh, you. Okay, Alessia, thank you very much um, for uh, other information. I'm, I'm here also by email. And, uh, and I think that uh, this master is really an innovation, uh, an innovative master, I think. Um, and um, I hope to see you um, in uh, this context. Uh, we have the necessity to, to develop a new uh, innovative perspective. And this is uh, an important tool to acquire all uh, uh, this kind of, of skill that uh, obviously I think it's um, really important for uh, the future of um, all of us and for the planet in general. Andreina, uh, Janka, Dimitra, instead, if you have another question, because for Alessia it's all clear. Thank you, Alessia, again. Well, uh, there is no question. Anyway, um, well, thank you, thank you again uh, uh, for uh, all of you, um, and um, I hope to read your, your uh, email and uh, obviously I'm um, at your disposal for, uh, for a question uh, about this important uh, master, I, I think, for the future of all of us. Uh, so, um, good evening and uh, uh, goodbye, I think. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Thank you again.